from the Kilpatrick Hills in Scotland. It's a very cold, frosty morning on the 2nd of January. Um, and we are here today to head up here because somewhere up here is the Wangi. What is the Wangi, you might ask, and why would you be interested? Um, I will tell you. So, what is the Wangi? Um, well, somewhere up here in the hills, there's a, a deep cleft in the rock and it creates a passageway that we're going to be able to walk through. Now, uh, local geologists have a pretty straightforward explanation about why it came, something about glacial movements and stuff like that, but local folk folklore has a much more interesting um, idea behind it. They reckon that the Wangi was actually created by the devil himself. As he was flying through the sky, he got really excited and uh, his tail was cracking away and it swiped down here and carved the Wangi uh, out of the rock. So hopefully if we can find it, we can actually walk through the passageway that the, the devil created. Like everyone, we found it. Potentially carved by the devil himself, the Wangi. Okay, it's time to go in. Okay, so as you can see, there's one thing we can confirm from this experience. The devil was big, is big, who knows? All right, we're about halfway there. We just climbed up that big bit that you saw. How was that? Good. Good, so we're gonna go. It looks like the devil was really excited when he made this because we've got to head down again, so I'll let you know how it goes. Come on. Okay, it's getting quite tight now. Uh, hopefully, that's us nearly out. Looks like daylight ahead. How are you doing down there? Good. Good, okay, a bit rocky here, so watch your step. Okay, so there we have it. The wangy geological oddity with the devil's footprint, who knows? Okay, see you later, guys.